Initially, I found my lump when I was 14. I found my lump myself while doing a self-breast exam. I felt a lump in the shower, and I actually immediately dis dismissed it, thinking I have no family history, I'm way too young. I found a lump in my breast. Um, on my own. As I was weaning my daughter, I found a lump all of a sudden, and I thought it's probably milk. As the years, you know, went on, I kind of just ignored it. I was stretching and I felt a really painful lump in the same breast, but like at 11 o'clock instead of the six o'clock. I started to kind of feel funny. I called my doctor and fortunately she took it seriously. I was luckily taken very seriously. The technician was like, oh, if you're in pain, that's a good thing because you know, cancer is so, is a silent killer. I could tell that something was wrong because the reaction of the sonographer. As soon as she started the sonogram, within 15 minutes, that face was like, no. That's the day they changed my life. Once you hear you have cancer, you kind of just hear white noise. The painful lump was benign and the one I ignored was the cancer. I was um, diagnosed stage four. I was a stage one and then became a stage 2A. I was diagnosed stage four. Stage four metastatic breast cancer. Metastatic breast cancer. Stage four of metastatic breast cancer is when your cancer has left the breast and gone to other organs, liver, brain, bones. I did six months of chemotherapy, Avastin, radiation, methotrexate, tamoxifen, chemo peel, Lupron, Herceptin. I am currently in remission, which is the best that you can be when you're stage four. But I have some scans coming up, so hopefully they will be good. It's no longer curable at that point. It is terminal. You will be uh, in treatment for the rest of your life um, until we find a cure.